in Providence. How's everybody feeling? Welcome to the kickoff of the Paid Lead for All National Bus Tour. My name is Dawn Hucklebridge and I'm the director of Paid Lead for All. And we are the national campaign of now more than 25 organizations leading the fight for paid family and medical leave for every working person in this country. We are here today because we have a once in a generation opportunity right now. We have the opportunity to finally catch up with the rest of the world, to finally do something meaningful for every working family in this country grappling with crisis, to build back better, and to make history by finally passing paid leave for all in the United States. Right now, we are still one of the only countries in the world that doesn't guarantee any form of paid leave for its workers. That was a crisis long before COVID, but the pandemic magnified just how important paid leave is to keep us in our jobs, to ensure that none of us has to choose between our family and a paycheck, or between our health and our work. Paid leave is a tool for public health, for economic resilience and growth, and for racial and gender equity. Paid leave would be a profound solution right now. And the time is now. We are kicking off the tour today in the great state of Rhode Island, one stop of 14, because you've had a paid leave law for years. You've already made the case, you've approved the law, and you've reached the benefits. So I want to say thank you to our partners who paved the way for paid leave at the state level and show just how valuable this policy is. So thank you to Economic Progress Rhode Island, right from the start, Rhode Island Kids Count, AAP and AARP Rhode Island, SCIU, and the whole coalition and our founding board member, Senator Gail Golden, who will be hearing from shortly. And I know the senators uh, had planned to attend. Unfortunately, they were called back to DC. They had a few things to do. Um, but I want to say thank you to their offices who showed up in support today.